Hi guys! So today I'm going to be reviewing Sigma brushes and this is what it looks like in the case. Now the case is bow leather I believe and it's really really nice quality. Um, it's not going to rip on you or anything. The only thing I have to say is that it does get a bit dirty which is a problem when it's around makeup because makeup stains a lot of stuff. So it just feels so high quality, really nice, and it's great to travel. Um, they do have a mini version of these brushes, but this, I have the full version, and it is called the Mr. Bunny um, kit. So let's open this. You just open it by taking off the buttons on the sides, and it turns into two brush holders. Now, this is really amazing because you can separate your eye brushes from your face brushes so that way you can find them a lot easier because there are 12 brushes in this kit so it's quite a bit of brushes. So I'm going to start off with face brushes and the first face brush that we have is this um, large powder F30 brush. And it's very big, very, very fluffy, very amazing. And um, the handles on these just look so pretty. Like, look at that. Look at how nice and just high quality this looks. It's amazing. So, um, yeah. So it's really pretty. And these brushes are soft. They're all synthetic brushes. So they just feel amazing. And... You use this for powder, um, you can use it for blush, you can use it for um, bronzer if you just want a nice sweep of it, but this is amazing and it's so big, like look at that, it's huge. Um, it's so, so soft though. Um, so yeah, so. Then there's this next one and this is Sigma Dual Fiber F50. And it just looks like this. And again, it has the nice handles. Um, this one is really great for cream products like foundation, cream blush. You can even use it with powder blush. You can use it to blend out your makeup a lot. You don't have to use any product exactly on the brush, just to blend. But it's really great. And this would have to be my favorite bra my favorite brush in the kit. I use this every single day. Um, so yeah, so it just it just has a flat top and you stipple it like that and you just apply the product on and it's great. This is a great brush. They're all great brushes. So next brush I'm going to be moving on to is this Sigma Large Angled Contour F40 brush, and it just looks like that. It's a it's a um, blush brush, and you can also use it for um, for bronzer, which I use it for blush and bronzer because it's great because it just fits right into the um, contour of your cheek, and this is amazing. It's again really soft. It picks up product really great. It doesn't like, it doesn't apply heavily enough. Um, heavy like, it just gives you the right amount of product on your skin and I love it. It's very soft. It makes your blush look very natural and it's beautiful. I love this brush. Again, I love all of them, but that one is really amazing. Um, second to last face brush there are only five face brushes in this kit is the foundation F60 um, brush and it's just a regular foundation brush but the thing about this is it's really soft and it blends amazingly you know how some foundation brushes that look like this they get hard and they get gross and they get disgusting and you can't blend it because it has streaks all over your face. Well, because this is synthetic and because it's so soft, 
it blends out amazingly. No streaks, um, unless it's dirty, of course. That's the only thing I found. If these brushes are dirty, they don't work as good. Now, this one got stained a lot more than the other brushes, as you can tell. And that's because, um, I mean, obviously you use um, different types of products with these brushes, but the foundation stains this brush a lot. And, you know, I... It's probably not as clean as it could be, but um, it's still going to be stained like this, unfortunately. And um, most of these brushes are really good with not getting stained, but unfortunately this is one of them that gets a little stained. Not a lot. It doesn't look bad, but it looks stained still. So, the... The last face brush I'm going to show you is this um, concealer brush, and it's an F70, and it's so tiny and cute, and this is amazing. This brush is amazing for concealer. I've never had a concealer brush um, be able to blend out and just pack on the product as good as this one. I've used many many concealer brushes and I never really thought that they were necessary well this one is amazing it's not gonna take away the product and just eat it up and soak in the brush it actually puts it on your skin very nicely and you know it doesn't look too heavy it doesn't look streaky it looks very very natural so moving on to eye brushes it's just in this they're all in this little container holder and they're all really, really beautiful brushes. So let's get started with this one. It's a large, um, large shader, E60. So it just looks like that. Now, um, I'm not sure what you would usually use this brush for, but I use it for the, um, my brow bone highlight and it works pretty good. So I absolutely love this brush because it is so big, it's nice, it's soft, it blends on my brow bone highlight color so well. It just looks like I don't even have to blend the two together because it, it's amazing. So I love, love this brush. Um, next brush is this um, medium angled shading E70. Um, now this brush is different. I've never seen a brush like this. It is angled, as you can tell. You can probably see. It is angled. Um, I use this for my crease or for my outer, outer color. And um, it is amazing. You know, at first I had a hard time actually using this brush. I didn't, I didn't even know what it was for. And I just had a hard time because I never, I've never seen a brush like this. And it's amazing. It really blends the product onto your, your crease amazingly and your outer crease. It's just really, really awesome. So next brush is this um, tapered blending E40 and it looks like this it's very fluffy it's like the face brush the big face brush except in a smaller version now this is to blend out all the products in your crease and and just all the colors now you can use this alone as just a crease brush which I, which I do sometimes and it is amazing. This is probably another one of my favorite eye brushes because it is just, it's beautiful. It's amazing. I love it and it blends so, so nicely. So next one is this Sigma Eye Shading E55. And it's just a regular, um, it's just a regular eye eyeshadow pencil or eye, not pencil but eyeshadow brush um it really really packs on the color amazingly and 
just the product goes on awesome. It goes on so smooth. You like just barely touch it. You sweep it across your lid and it's like there. And I find that some brushes actually do a horrible job at packing on the color. And this brush does an amazing job at that. It also, you could also use it with, um, with your eyeshadow primer to if you don't want to get your hands dirty you could just use this brush as that with that and this is amazing really really packs on color and most eyeshadow brushes really lack that so the last three brushes are eyeliner brushes now they're all different eyeliner you know brushes I'll start off with the bigger one and this is a pencil E30 and it is a bigger one um, you know you could use this as an eyeliner um, as an eyeliner blush brush Ugh, I keep getting the two confused you could use this as an eyeliner brush but um, what I use this mostly for is my outer V and um, it really really works. It's amazing. Now you do have to blend it out with uh, with a big fluffy brush. This one. You do have to, if you're going to use this one, you have to blend it with this. But this is amazing and it really, it doesn't apply the color too heavily. Mm. Some people want that, but I find that if it's a darker color, I want it to go on lighter rather than darker. So this is amazing. All these brushes are amazing. So next one I'm going to do is the eyeliner and this is E15 I think. I don't know. This this brush is so small I can hardly see the color. But or the the number. But it's just so tiny and it's cute and it's the perfect eyeliner brush. Perfect. It like it starts off bigger and then it gets really tiny so that way you can get the exact eyeliner look you want. You can even do a wing with this liner. And you can do a wing with this other one I'm about to talk to you about. It is the Small Angle um, E65. Now this one is probably my favorite eyeliner brush. It's just, it's so tiny and angled and I love it because it's so easy to really put on the, um, your eyeliner because it is angled so it's it's a little larger it just blends so easily and I love love the, all these brushes so my overall review of these brushes are that they are great quality they are amazing the price is a bit up there because you are paying for what you get you're paying for high quality brushes and I know that to some of you the price may not be um, as much as your like MAC brushes or anything like that but these are made to be affordable really high quality brushes and they really are. I believe the price is $135 for this. I may be mistaken um, give or take a few dollars but these brushes have really saved me with um, with when doing my makeup. They honestly just... I am so glad I finally got these. Like, they really change the way your makeup looks and goes on. And it's amazing how much just brushes can actually save your life, kind of. Well, they didn't really save my life, but... They really, really, like, just are fun to use and amazing, and they're just awesome brushes. They are high quality brushes. They are really up there, and I would recommend, um, they have a ton of different colors. They, um... They have a ton of different colors, a ton of different kits, and a you can even get these brushes alone if you wanted to. And um, 
Of course, they are cheaper in a kit, which, like I said, this is the Mr. Bunny kit. It just has the silver and then the black handle and um, the kind of white and um, part on the brushes and then the dark part on the brushes. So these are synthetic, which are really awesome because they're not going to shed, they're not going to get really just nasty. They are amazing. I really recommend you guys go buy these. Um, I will have a link in the down bar where you can get Sigma brushes. And um, that is all I wanted to say about these, guys. I wish you could be here to feel them and just touch them and to feel how great quality they are. They are amazing. So um, these are all my babies and I love them and I hope you guys enjoyed this little review. I will talk to you guys soon. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye.